and welcome back to still trying to cast spells that we don't have to mana for. This episode we are actually going to be mana -less. we're heading down to level 7, the anti-magic level wherein we shall get our shit fucking wrecked. No, we're going to find a amulet of passage, we're going to pretend that that's not a secret door even though it totally should be, and we're going to do it all without spells. This level is... In theory, this this is the level that we resolve the story, the, 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 the plot point in the introduction of the game. It's also where, if I really wanted to, I could just jump there. Uh, 09. Jump here. Put our Ring of Leap back on. Oi, game. Oh, game, you and your b beautiful jumping mechanics. Alright, so. There are very, very nasty creatures through here. We've got Reapers. We have Reapers, we have Dire Ghosts. We should be okay here. Coins. Fucking loot. Like, the loot's no better, of course. What do we have? A ragged scroll. Decided to explore the mines. There must be some way to bypass the maze. If only there were a way across the pit of lava. But my, max, my maps indicate that there must be a secret door in this area. I enter now. We have... Some badly worn male leggings and a worn breastplate, neither of which appear to be magical. But we don't know- oh, hello. Do you have a moment to meet my sword? See, we took a hit, we survived. Can hear more critters floating around though. Shuffling around, whatevering around. Uh, we've got some goblins. I'm actually quite happy to just put these guys to the sword. The medallion is easily found enough, but I took a wrong turn and we don't have it. So we don't need a medallion. We've got our sword. That is all the, the medallion of passage we need. So these goblins are just nothing. They're fucking... they're just fodder at this point in the game. Is that a missile protection shirt? It is! Hit these guys. Just die, please. And you come back here. Here, boy. Thank you. Get out of the door. Hitting the door isn't going to hurt, hurt our weapon now. This sword is indestructible, but it's a pain in the ass when you're trying to kill something and you're hitting the furniture instead. Hey, remember that point I made last episode about creating too many things? And then I go on the fucking killing spree and generate all these extra sprites? I actually really I know that I shouldn't do that I shouldn't just load and cop out but I don't want to flood the world with junk locked locked I don't want to flood the world with junk because we actually need to have the best chance of a particular NPC spawning that we can 
for no other reason than I want to show it off again. We'll come back here and we'll kill this thing. Feel free to die any time, Reaper. Thank you. Through here. Oh, that was a gazer that we were hearing before. We give no fucks about that. secret door there. I have a feeling there's a secret door here that opens from the other side. Die ghost. And yes, I, I am aware that the, the bug I'm referring to that destroys items is only on the floppy disk version of the game. It is not in the CD version of the game, which greatly increased all of the item spawn limits. Um, however, this is the floppy disk version of the game. This is my old DOS copy from the from the early 90s. I have it. I have a uh, a legitimate archival backup copy that I refer back to for occasions like this. That I play through Defend purely because I can't be bothered patching the sound that comes with the GOG version, which I assume would not be afflicted by that bug. Not that way, I just want to find my way back to where that plate mail was, honestly. So that is the way in. That's what she said. Oh, it's right there. Literally right there. Okay. Oh, hello. And you're dead. We can still hear something else. I wonder if another thing has spawned in here. What I should do, so it's not the, the sprites themselves, it's the number of items that's the problem, so it won't matter if I amalgamate that pile of gold coins into one, or at least it shouldn't. And you're dead. Well, that was a secret. So we'll head back. Ah, well, there's a medallion of passage too. So we'll just go ahead and save our game now. I was thinking, yeah, we'll backpedal and we'll jump back up and get the medallion that um, whatever his name was, Castor, I think was, I think it was. Go back and get the medallion that he lost in the mines. But no, we'll get this one instead. And you know what, just in case it is based on the number of sprites in the world, which makes no sense, honestly, because if that were the case, then why would it cull items from your inventory in the, the, the sheer quantity that it does? Um, Say, if we're not going to go through there yet, because we've got a door here to beat down first. Oh, I saw that. I'm sure I saw a secret door along here. Apparently not. Boop. I mean, what we could do as well is jump back across and sleep on level 6 to identify our gear. We might just do that. Anything that's rubbish we can just hurl into the lava. Let's 
Is this opening? Yes. So that is a pit of lava. Now there's nothing we care about. Save our game. No, I hit the wrong key at the wrong time there. Right. Up the stairs we go. Literally just a breastplate. I am curious. Oh my lord, no, I didn't mean to do that. Sleep again. Are either of these magical? No, they're not. So we're going to restore our game. And we can just go right ahead and fuck them off. Don't want to go through there yet. We're not ready to go through there yet. Oh, where your medallion? Here it is. Oh, you go straight through, you're not hanging around. Sure. And by that, I mean I'm going to quickly have a poke around and see what I can loot. Oh, please tell me I can push you over. Yes! Ha! Oh, I see that chain actually. Oh my lord, move! Chain actually opens that door. But do we want to be on this side of the door? Maybe? say before we go over there for that reason oh my fucking god that one pixel made all the difference apparently oh and this brings us back to where we were okay down. Oh, it doesn't really matter too much, so we can just scoot through there. Music can calm right the fuck down. Thank you, game. Save. I want to see what's... Yes, totally fling yourself to the right and into the wall. Where is this? Oh, this is just back to the start as well, apparently. Okay. Nope, we don't want to save. So, what is here? What is here? We've got another one of them. I'm sure there are secret doors around here. We don't want to be there. We know we don't want to be there. Yeah, 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 there's the medallion. Thank you, kind goblin. I think this one's the trap. Yeah, this one's the trap. Apple. Fish. So you see what we did there, we just emptied the pack so he can keep his pack and we're still going to take his stuff. Ah, uh, this is where the, um, where that fighter lost his amulet of passage. It's just around here actually, not here, sorry. Oh, this is a trap, there'll be spiders. Called it. Take that off in here. That's another trap. 
Oh well. Where'd he go? Yeah, I see you running away. You little coward. Way down to level 8. Which we do want. Just not right now. Now we have Naruto. Ah, uh, he's not running though. Um, what brings thee here? I must defeat the wizard Tybal. Well, watch thyself, there are nasty spiders all around. My friend was just killed by one some distance to the north. He had a key that would allow one to enter a place of some importance. There one might find an item that grants, uh, that, that allows the owner to get through Tybal's maze. Dost thou know why my, why my magic powers have been drained? A mysterious orb drains the magic from every living creature on this level. And that's why I can't cast spells. Indeed, the orb drains thy power and transfers it somewhere. Where it is put to some foul purpose. Dost thou know who is behind this? Tybal. He is evil itself even though I've never met him. Um, break the orb's grasp on the area. We basically stab him. Uh, and we, we want a piece from the, the level below. I know not, but I think some friends of mine who languished in prison discovered its secret before they were captured by Tybal. If, if, thou, if thou canst talk to them, perhaps they can help thee. I will go talk to them. So we want to find the key. We want to find the other amulet of passage, just because we can. And then we want to go back to that path down to level 8. Because there we can find orb rock, which is how we... Yeah. There's the secret door. Orb rock is how we um, destroy the, the anti-magic orb. It comes back out there. Don't want that yet. Don't care about that yet. And I may just take the stairs to level 8 when I see them. Oh, please. Even the spider backed off, like, well, man, I didn't mean to bite you, sorry. And I'm like, yeah, I give no fucks. And we level. Because, you know, we totally have skills left to improve at this end of the game. Catch and release. Right, so we've got the key. We don't really need to worry too much about that other amulet of passage. We're not going to be any worse off for only having the one. Just head for that stairs down now. Oh, damn it. I'm tapping jump. I'm tapping jump, you fucking thing. <sighs> I'm jumping. I'm fucking jumping. Thank you, you cunt of a game. Okay, so what's down here? Poor choices. Just kill you. Nothing to identify at this point. Yeah. 
he's nearly dead. Oh, I don't, don't think I mentioned it yet. The color of the eyes there it reflects the health of whatever we're fighting. <laughs> that imp's like, I got this. As we, you know, hate fuck the stone golem. But no, totally, the imp's got this. Some rubble. Shitload of gems. An undamaged gold ring. Of poison resistance. Fucking useless at this end of the game, honestly. Do we have nothing here? Oh, really? Oh, set imp again. <laughs> oh, he's swatting a bug. You're not going to talk? Well, can't take the chance that you'll turn. Of course I go straight into a wall. What's up here? Nothing. <sighs> Die. Oh, this just brings us here. Okay. We want to go around. Game with all the gems that we really don't need. Unfortunately, the orb rocks are not here. I was really hoping that we'd find some. And here we have the fire elemental. Probably the most dangerous enemy in the game, really. At a distance, they throw fireballs. I don't quite know what their melee attack is. I'm not really keen to find out either, honestly. You're dead. This, I believe, just takes us back the way we came. Which I don't care about right now. Don't really have much of a choice. But not where I want to go. Oh my lord. Yeah, I've just, of course, just flee, flee me to the fucking side, of course. Oh my lord, game. I was holding the walk here, so I walked that fast here. That forward movement, if we're going to call it that, that was me holding the walk key in the lava. Because reasons. Was that orb rock? No, that's just rubble stuck in the wall. Well, this ring of poison resist, we're just going to leave it there. It's no good to me. We're not getting poisoned by anything at this end of the game. We have the key that we need. I don't know if we want to go through there. I actually think that we're better off going through the other side of this maze. As we loop around like we do. This way? I don't think so. Ah. Uh, that guy was the best part of Ghost of Peace run through of this game, I swear it. Just fucking howling when I saw that. So 
we'll just save. And what do you have for us? Medallion to pass, here it is. Do we want to go this way? Yeah, this is the, the bullshit one. We're gonna load our game and just see what else we can do before we go that way. leads us oh fuck that for a joke I remember that bit I remember being very ragey about that bit last time I played this ah oh, if anything is if dungeon crawlers top of anything it's that one of those should be a secret button and then not um, let's see I don't recall what the defense mantra was. Oh well. Just gonna alternate between the two. Right, so that's... Oh, really? Just plodding along doing gazer things, apparently. And so we should have no issue telling what's magical and what isn't. Mana boost, lesser heal. See, most of our potions now are auto-identified. Auto Greater heal, restore mana. Not all of them, but as you can see, most of them. Crown and the Gauntlets could stand to be magical, just saying. Really? Really, Rat? How much health did he have? That was impressive. Uh, what else? Nothing there. Nothing there. What's down here? Troll, of course we do. Not that he's much of a worry. Now, is this crown any good? It's not cursed. It's in better shape than the one we had, so we'll put the perfect one on. We'll see what that does over time. Another way down to level 8. I think we'll take that way down to level 8 before we commit to the next area. But we're going to do it next episode. So I'm going to quick save. And I will see you then. Until then, cheers.